Hello YouTube. I received this for Christmas. This old Craftsman box. My father-in-law had passed away during this year and my mother-in-law gave me this for Christmas. Uh, my father-in-law wasn't really a mechanic. He did some tune-ups on cars. He wasn't a carpenter or a mechanic. But he'd had this box so we don't know where it came from. He could have inherited it himself. Okay, we'll open it up here. I will be looking for a key for this. Someone had pried this open, okay, and I'm wondering if that's why they put this piece of wood in here. Because if you lifted this without that latch, it may bow or do something. But there's a number on the box, 6517. There's a number on the latch. I'll include pictures of where it's made. I think it says Excelsior, Bradford, Connecticut over here that says that's a knockout for a square so this was raised I may take a picture inside so this piece could be knocked out okay moving in a little bit closer also include a photo of this it says level compartment which makes me believe this is a carpenter's box because it is so long you can put your hand saws and stuff in, so it has to be. I believe it to be. There's no handle on this, even though there's a hole in the, each end. So, we don't know if this had a handle or not. Okay, this all came with it. Everything in here, I'll have a photo of that. Everything in here is made in the USA. A uh, pair of tin snips. Weiss or Wiss. Let's say basin wrench. It's to take your faucet loose under your getting your kitchen sink that takes the nut off it made in USA uh, Chicago so Chicago something else on it uh, speedy basin wrench Put a photo of that this is test your antifreeze I have the kind with the little dial on it presto uh, they're more accurate than these uh, paint brush which I can always use on a drill press or on a lathe or something, clean up chips. This is made in USA, also. Not a super high dollar one, but it's brand new looking. This is also made in USA. This is for flaring copper pipe. Superior Tool Company, Cleveland, Ohio. I have a cheaper one of these. A little buggered up there, but cheaper one of these, but it's not built like that. This is a pulley. Just a pulley for, we'll use whatever. Uh, two oil filter wrenches, I'll pull one out. These are also USA. I have a big one, I do not have any small ones. Torch tip cleaner. Tells your sizes. If I can get it open cleaning your torch tip different size little type a battery terminal cleaner and I think that about covers it it's kind of a shame it has two holes in here but maybe there was a reason for that maybe the top one you added a piece of wood in here there you go. I'm real happy to have an old tool like this. I did clean it, wash it, put some car wax on it out of a bottle, liquid car wax. And it is shinier. So it will be put away that way to be protective. I don't know if I'll ever use it. Just maybe something I'm going to add to my collection. But there we go. I'll include plenty of photos. And thank you for watching.